Hi Cancer, welcome to my channel. This is the weekend tarot reading session for you Cancer. I hope you are well. I hope you're fine and safe and doing good. This is a weekend tarot reading session for the Cancer friends out there. What can I get for Cancer please? What is the love reading and general opportunity reading that's meant for you to know and ready for you to know? This is for you Cancer, okay? Before I start, I would like to thank you for coming back. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thanks for being here today. Guest viewers, if you haven't, click the subscribe button and the bell. Please, please do it now if you're interested and if you are keen. And if you would like to further support my channel, I invite you please to also follow me on my blog, sunshine-tv.com. We send out a weekly astrology in there, you know, full moon and new moon update astrological views and opinions over there you know relationship and other uh, mindfulness and wellness um information that we can share i've got a two writer and blogger so really interesting if you're interested have a look at the website okay apologies i'm not offering a private reading right now i'm not asking any sort of donation so please be very mindful and careful who you engage online you know, uh, there's a lot of scammers and imposters. So let's protect this channel and also the tarot community on YouTube by not engaging with those trolls, imposters, and scammers, okay? I'm going to shuffle the reading again, okay? I'm going to shuffle it, the cards twice, and then we start the reading. One and two. And I feel like another one. All right. Let's see what's coming towards you, Cancer. The overall energy is you've got the five of wands. This is a competition, okay? Competition in your competition, not in agreement with someone with somebody. The five of wands, this is an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This could be an actual, you know, competition at work or competition at home. Or it could be competition when it comes to relationship. And it's attention seeking, um, the five of wands, the thing about the five of wands, Cancer, is that, you know, you are all have the same goal, but the direction of how you want to execute the goal, it is not in alignment, okay? So in here, the story of the five of wands is that all of this, they're wanting to build a house, but this person would like to do it in the right, in the left this is going to the right direction. This is upward. This is downward. So you see, you both want each other. You both want the same thing. But the ways, the love language, the the way you process it, the way they process it is different. It could be you're dealing with a person who is extrovert. You're introvert. You're dealing with a person who's aggressive and you're not. So you want you want to end up at the same finish line but different strategy on how to get there that is where the conflict start or competition like you should not be competing against one another you should be working together mm -hmm. um let's see your influence the past situation and your energy your input um you've got here the three of cups you know it could be a dating situation you could be dating with this person getting to know it could be related to an event a party it could be a reunion um this competition this competition could be related to a close friend a close friendship community or someone close to you nine of swords three of cups there's no doubt that you're you're competing or in our in argument with someone who's really close to you it could be a best friend could be family member could be a lover that you're dating you know you could be dating now three of cups is dating getting to know um you know ten of pentacles because of this argument because of this misunderstanding of where to go left right a lot of there's also a lot of chatting a lot of communication um i find the three of cups as you know cheerful like you know, this is your energy, three of cups, five of wands. Like I'm I'm getting I'm getting a connection where instead of arguing instead of arguing or attacking one another or commenting, you know, do it in in some sort of if you're going to challenge or if you're gonna challenge or you're gonna say something that would make the other person feel like it's a threat or it's it's a criticism 
you should do it in a personal way, a strategy where you're going to deliver it in a joking way or something that it's fun and easy and convenient, you know, because, you know, for some of you, it could be, it could be your arguing always over the phone or in text so instead of instead of getting things you know in in written because there's no emotion and it's very impersonal over um text why don't you try to give this person a call so there's more emotion to it because it could be misled so for some of you you know do it casually sometimes complicated situation or argument or conversation or subject it, if you break it up you know you don't have to do it one blow, you know. Break it up in pieces, you know. And, and take it easy. I'm really getting like this three of cups. You're, you're once upon a time very close. You're very close. You know how to cheer them up. You know, it's the right timing to, to bring up this conflict. Yeah. Eight of pentacles. They're still willing to work things out with you. Knight of cups. Right now, you know, they're willing to work things out. Right now, hidden energy is that... They're probably not interested, but there's still a willingness that you guys could still collaborate because you have the same goal. The five of wands, this is conflict, you know, conflict, but the same interest, conflict of interest. Yeah, you know, it's 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 you're wanting the same, but your interest on how to kind of, you know, build your building. OK, you, me, we want to live together, but we don't know which which house do we choose. We're con in conflict of that choice but we want to live together you know this is this is the vibe knight of cups so for some of you this could be money you know ten of pentacles that the reason this person could not concentrate on you it's because they're very focused on career you could be dealing with a person who the reason why their choices is like this it's because they're not stable so they need to prioritize and consider the cost you know, I'm getting that the cost, the price, it's a matter to them. For you, maybe you're more, you're more, let's say you have more money, you have more budget. For some of you, if this is a relationship, you have more time. You know, you have more time. They don't have, you know, very busy and focused at work. There's a lot of overtime with them. But if you, if you look back in the past, if you look at the pattern, whenever they're available, they give you their time, a quality time. So there's a lot of one thing to try. Magician card. They're just being real or keeping it real. I'm tapping a six of swords. So in here, you're dealing with a person who actually, they don't want to go. They don't want to let go. They don't want to argue. In fact, I'm seeing them returning. It's just for them, argument is not practical. Criticism is not practical. It's conversation should be objective and i see this person when they have time they'll give you quality but they're struggling with that this person is working hard towards a project let's see if it's love they're not over with you definitely not over with you if this is a relationship you've got a page of cups they're not feeling like approaching you right now they're not over you they're not feeling approaching you approaching you right now you know, I don't see them wanting to do that. But, you know, but when they have time, they'll give you quality one. They don't feel like it. But I see them six of swords in reverse returning if this is love, you know. Right, the right now energy weekend, it's more of a no. I'll just be productive and keep, you know, keep keep my daily, you know, daily, daily thing with me. It, it's not ready to connect. Yeah, it's not ready to connect, to be honest. But it's not. it hasn't moved on. The project is still here. The interest to work with you, to be with you, it's still here. Let's see if it's career or money or work. Yeah. Emotions. And so I see them popping in. Like, I see them. Look at this. It looks like the, the face pop. You know, I see them connect. If this is work or if this is work, family. If this is work or family or friends, I see you guys, you know, talking again. This is them. This is you. You know, I see you. I see, you can't avoid each other. It's in a, it's unavoidable. So if you're kind of in an energy of waiting and a bit frustrated, they cannot avoid you. They know that they're going to address the concern. And they will address it, you know, there's some sort of completion. But I don't think it's going to happen in... 
I don't think it's gonna happen sooner. I don't think it's gonna happen overnight. And um, and it's also of if the more you wait, the more you feel the the more you wait, the more you feel the weight of waiting. You know, keep yourself yeah, ten of cups. There's a good outcome. You've got to really wait. Let's see what else. Higher of one card in reverse. Because if you push, you know, higher of one card, a tower card. Like if you force, if you challenge this, you might break up, you know. Give it time, you know. I'm hitting the word green. So it's going to go green or it's going to, you know, things will take place. Things will fall into places if you just give it a bit of time. I'm seeing the mid of month as a possible connection or uh, reviewing it again. I'm seeing you signing contract for some of you guys. I'm seeing you shaking hands. I'm seeing you spending time again with them for some of you. Um, I'm seeing you guys having an apology, you know, explaining to you that they've been busy, you know, most especially if this is a love relationship. I don't think the conversation has ended. I think the door is still open between the two of you. Yeah, one more. And I've seen that 11-11. Right now, they're not feeling the right now. The vibe is it's not looking healthy. They'd rather avoid you than to fight you and lose you forever. Yeah. Four of Pentacles in the verse. They will release they will release the interest of connecting. And when it's ready, I see them ten of cups. In Knight of Pentacles, more quality. You know, more quality than quantity. There's a lot of there's a lot of energy in here where it's about time and effort, you know. Quality versus quantity, okay? I see them honestly coming around. And you'll be happier if you regroup later on, okay? So, you know, relax. Um, it's going to be in favor if you let time, you know, and the universe manage this situation. You are at the same page. They're not an opposition. They're not an enemy. They want to work with you. And because of the conflict, because of something came up, the dynamic is the, the, the dynamic of you and this person it's quite challenge but i see them i see them you know still turning their you know i still see them six of swords in reverse coming back around so chillax um and they will stay in touch and stay in contact okay so this is your reading thank you so much cancer for tuning in thanks for being here i will see you in the weekly reading i'll be uploading it soon and the weekly reading it's all about love Okay, see you guys. Bye.